I did not expect to see that face. Who is- who are you? I don't know who you are. Get off my screen. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to Fatal Frame 4 Mask of the Lunar Eclipse stream. Yes, we're finally back. I'm so, so excited to do this. So hype. And yes, it's a cheeky late stream. I know, mental. Uh, <laughs> yes, yeah, sorry for like the last minute of a uh, notice for this. But yes, no, I wanted to stream this, so now that I have time to, and not being so much distracted or busy, for that matter. But yes, we are back after finishing Resident Evil 4, which thank you so much for everyone joining. I really, really, I really appreciate everyone being there. It was so much fun. I didn't want it to end, but maybe it doesn't have to end. Um, so now we're back to the foyer frame floor route. I can't wait. I'm super, super excited for this. So, um... Let's get onto the summary of things, shall we? Uh, and hope this creepy face can go away soon. It's very weird. So yes, a summary. You you are getting very close, right? <clears throat> if no one remembers something, does that mean it never happened? What do you guys think? If no one remembers something, does that mean it never happened? Have you guys ever had that situation with yourself? I think I'm starting to. So we have Ruka, another one of the girls who disappeared 10 years previously, comes to Rugetsu Island after Mitsuki and Madoka. Ruka grew up on the island, but after the incident she had, uh, after the incident she and her mother left, Ruka was on her, uh, has her own responsibilities, uh, sorry, reasons for coming here. I just wanted to read that so I can get away from this damn face. There we go. <laughs> Distracting me. Ruka wants to piece together her lost memories. Why doesn't she remember where she was born or what her father looked like? What was done to her and the other girls? What happened on the island the day they were taken? While exploring Rugetsu Hall, in search of the key of her memories, Ruka encounters the ghost of Madoka in the room next to the Oso Museum. Museum. Then she then looks in the mirror and is greeted by a vision of her own face, warped and distorted, which is the room behind us, by the way, that we last left off with her. Um, do we get to play as Ruka, I'm assuming? That could have absolutely effing scared me. <gasps> we do! My baby! Oh yes, we get to play her. Oh, hang on. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I know. Okay, I, I know what level. I think I know what level. Well, I know what that chair is about. I remember this. As first level, I don't. But bits and pieces. Ooh, ooh, ooh I'm back as Duka. Yes. Heck yes. Uh, I didn't change these cameras, did I? Yes! Selfies. So, this is where we last left off with Ruka, and we had a uh, Modoka literally standing there, like, um, had her head, her hands on her face, her head buried in her palms, and we had to take her out, unfortunately. Speak of the devil. I don't understand. Since I saw the one with no face, I don't understand anymore. My face is breaking. But I remember now, me crying. Ayako. Ayako doesn't even deserve a capital A. A hand grabbing me, the mask is coming, blood red, the music, the fallen face. No, don't show me anymore. I don't remember. I, I remember, sorry. We were chosen. It hurts everything. Shut it out. Shut it all out. I don't want to see. Yeah, you wish I was going to say the top line. <laughs> I want to shut it out, but the moon is calling. The moon. I want to be somewhere dark, somewhere dark with no moon. I'm going back to my room. Huh. Can we access her room now, actually? Because we were able to as Mitsuki. 
which by the way that video the next episode of fail frame will come out to youtube i have to actually play through the level again unfortunately it won't have the same reactions i'm sorry it's just it it, it didn't want to work when i tried editing it and it was such a bugger go away oh my lord this better be important then that gave me a heart attack 10? Ooh! Lovely! Okay. Right, and I think that is everything in here right now. Yeah. Okay. So, we don't technically have a lead, far as I know, because we were just hunting Madoka. So, the only thing I can go off now, she says she's gone back to her room, so maybe we can go to the, her room then. Ooh, I'm surprised you didn't try to grab my hand for that. Which, by the way, I need to not do that. Oh my goodness. It can sometimes pop up ghosts for me doing that. Like, just out of nowhere. Just out of absolute spike. <laughs> yes, we can try and upgrade. Oh my god, the upgrades are kind of spensy. They're a little expensive, huh? Well, maybe if I don't max out max power... Is this blast? Does that say blast? Yes, it does. Right. Improves camera's charging time. Okay, see. I like that. Improves film. Yes. Storage. Increased power. We haven't used the lens yet. Wait, is that... Actually, is that for that receives po spirit points received? Oh, uh, but the thing is, spirit points are just for shops now. So it's really no point. Unless you're doing a more difficult... Mm, not even then. Storage. Increase maximum number of stored... Yeah, so that's related to the lens, I believe. We haven't even used the lens yet. So, it's no point doing that. I would like... Look, we are one. We are one jelly bean off from just doing the max power. I kind of want to do max power. But these will... These will suffice for now. <laughs> these will do for now. Um, My girl... How do we, how do we, do we, do we use, how do we use your lens, lenses? Wait, you press square to use an upgrade lens if you have enough storage power. Oh, so, okay, it's, it's square to do it. I don't really have any, uh... Oh, I have one power stored. I'll have to give these a try, because honestly... Uh -huh. The patience, huh? Nurse heading to station. Okay. Yeah, so the lenses are really, really good. They're, they're worth making use of. Ah, uh, see, I know I'm following the story, but I would honestly go the opposite way of where she's coming just because but uh, I will I will keep this playthrough going I I just can't I can't wait to 100% this game as well as Resi ah uh, that music again who's playing that music I don't know but I'm about to smash it up oh uh, this has a ch this this does something oh I believe this music... What does it do? I don't think it's... Does it summon... I think it summons stronger ghosts. I could be absolutely wrong. Or it brings more ghosts out. Either way, it's not, it's not a good thing for us. Yeah? I missed her! How did I miss her? Ah! Oh, turn it off! I got too close to her! Yeah, I don't, I don't want to have that on. Oh my god, I missed her photo twice! Oh. <laughs> Man, I couldn't see the, um, the ring go blue, so... But that, the second time I ran into her, so that was annoying. 
Uh, nurse's logbook three. This nurse, by the way, I've always felt sorry for this nurse. She never gets a break. I feel really sorry for her. Uh, one item's report today. Experimented today with musical therapy, playing music over the speakers between 12 p.m. and 5 p.m. That's so long. As usual, the music was a selection from the moon sounds. Some patients, especially the younger children, were seen present extreme reactions not normally seen in them. Since the therapy has been proven to produce an effect, it has been carried out again in the future. However, I believe most of the reactions seen today were not positive. The behavior of our patients still holds many mysteries for us. The next, uh, the next time such experiments are carried out, please prepare as such as possible for ante anticipated situations. Yeah, no, that's a no for me for that music. Like, oh my goodness. I don't blame that your patients were going insane. Right, how do I back to it? Where's that coming from? Wait, no, that's not Madoka. It is Ayako. I was thinking that's Ayako because I think Madoka is top right. Oh, really? Oh, oh, no, I'm on your side. I will go to a room. Don't worry about it. Don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. I am going to blast you, though. I'm going to try and blast you. Like I said, she doesn't get a break. I like how I said I felt sorry for this nurse and I just did that to her. I am so sorry. A meeting will take place tomorrow at 6 p.m. to explain the experimental treatment of playing music over the spe uh, speaker system. Information about the location of meeting will follow the nurse in charge of room 07, 207, sorry, in the new building should bring the music score to the room next door. Oh. Ayako's room. Ah, uh, that's the room we left. That's the room we left um, Misaki in. So actually, I want to check. S Blah, I'm really gonna get punished for doing that. <laughs> uh, right. I want to know. Yeah, there's her room. Where's um, Madoka's? This one. Okay. Right. Madoka's room's on the way there. I I want to pop to her room. And see if anything happens there, considering we got a letter. Who knows, it might be fun. Or it just might be locked. Madoka's room. Oh, the way she said that, because of what happened. Oh my god, I'm traumatizing this poor girl. Oh, the music in here is so scary. And the mirror, we lift this up, dude. Oh, something is in here. Something's in here. Did I get you last time? Yeah, I did. Wait, something's in here. Wait, something's in here. It's over here. It's in the drawer. Don't grab me. Modoka's notebook. <clears throat> I wake up and I- 10 pages! Oh my. Okay, we're gonna get a little bit of a backstory with this, so guys, ah, sit back. <laughs> I wake up and I realize I'm looking at the moon. When I look at the moon, my mind becomes a little, uh, wait, my mind comes back a little. Um, but now I think I'm going to stop looking. So if you guys remember her name, um, uh, her last name uh, is part of the Moon family. It, it, I think it means Moon, and I'm trying to remember what was the uh, what was the name? What's the word? What's the Japanese word for Moon? Was it su 
Is this do something Mori? I'm not sure. We might be able to check in a minute. Ruka, do you remember? I wanted to get back what I couldn't remember, but some things are left are best left forgotten. But it's okay. It doesn't matter. It's all going away. It's all going away. Oh my. It's over. Oh, was that her last diary to me? I just got chills. Was that a chair there? That was a chair in the way. Ah! My Luca is spinning all over the place. So I guess that was a secret diary for her then. No. Oh. So will it tell me... Can I read... No, this is open. Um... Okay, hold on. If I go to files, maybe, maybe it'll tell me, because I, I want to, um, here we go. Was it like, what was her name? Um, I know that her mother writ it to her. Here we go. It is! Oh my god, I got it right! Sukumori! Yes! So, Suki in our name means moon, don't you? Like, do you know that the Suki in our name means moon, don't you? That means the moon protects us and keeps us safe. So don't worry, Madoka. Yeah, that's right. So she was just telling her, basically, they're part of the moon family, that the moon will just keep you, you know, all safe and better. But in that note with us, she says she doesn't want to look at the moon anymore. It's really sad. Oh. And now we're going to this bloody dreadful room. She was very close to Ayako, actually. I think she's at the end of this hall. Oh, is there? Is there a doll up here? Oh, did it spin me around? Where am I? Is there a doll up here? No, it's one of these shelves. There's a doll up on this shelf somewhere. Oh, is that you? Oh, I've got you, haven't I? Yeah, I got you already. Mm, okay. What is the back turn in this, actually? Is it this? There we go. Alright, I've got it. I've got it. <laughs> so many games with back turns. I am not going in there! I don't- I know what's in there, like, kind of, but I don't want to. I can't carry anymore. Okay, so there's a stone mirror there, that's good to know. Did I get- I think there's a doll here? No, that ain't it. Was there not a doll here? Oh, yeah, no, I've already picked that up. Medical file, Ayako. If you got so if you guys remember, Ayako is this witch of a child. She was a bully to Madoka to the point that she killed her bird. And she bullied the nurse that we also kind of just blasted. <laughs> This child is not okay, but she's known to be an extremely, like, she's a very special kid in this place, and we don't know why. Ayako, female, age 12. She was older than them? So all the girls in this were seven, and Ayako was 12. My goodness. Patients exhibit symptoms of sudden memory loss as well as singular lack of ethics and more, more, oh god, molarity. The enjoyment she gets from causing pain and taking life. Okay. We know that already. She may be using aggressive behavior as a means to keep a grip of her sense of self. Other patients have displayed tendencies to cling to objects or aspects of personality, but Ayako is the first to cling to violence. Her moonlight syndrome may only be in a moderate stage of advancement, but she requires careful observation. I think everyone needs to be armoured up when they go near her, because from the last time we played as well, we saw that she was dragging a nurse by her hair to her room.
Don't grab me. Good. Oh, we could actually... Over here? God, you got a, a lot of stuff in your room. Don't grab me! Oh, oh it gave me 10 crystals back! I love it. <sighs> right. I know what's in this room. Um... Oh god, it is! It's exciting! Okay, it's, it's messed up. It's exciting, but... Oh. Hey! Get back off! You're not having my hair! Okay, time to blast you. I was trying to tell my viewers. Well, what are you doing? I was trying to tell my viewers about that room, but here you are ruining it. Yeah, you're a little close. Sorry. You need a timeout, kid. Ah. Uh, ah. No. No. Oh, my stone mirror saved me. I got cornered. I don't like how they've made the camera, by the way. Um, that you can move it. Either. Where are you? You can even move it with. Okay, away. I haven't been able to get a felt frame shot on her yet. So you, they made it so that you can move it normally with... Oh my god. With like... Ah! So you can use it with the sticks, which you used to be able to back in the day. Or you do this. It has motion sensor, and I hate that. You got really cool eyes, but you're still you're still an evil, evil little child. Oh look, she keeps cancelling my charge. There we go. Yeah, you're having an extra blast. Evil thing, sit down. Oh. Evil, evil thing. Right, time to go in this room. Uh, if anyone is sensitive to um, creepy sounds, I'm giving you a fair warning right now. That's what I wanted to say before she decided to jump on me and pull my hair back and thinking she can do what she did to the nurse, which is a no-no. <laughs> I'm very excited for this part. I hope you guys are as well. Oh, let's get this over with. I've got bloody headphones on and everything. Isn't that the most charming thing you've ever heard? I've got to read this while she's making those noises. I might be able to remember something if I play this in the dining hall. Okay, we've got to lead. Oh, okay, no, I'm still reading. Okay, five pages. You're generous. You're very generous. I feel cold. 
Memory and music are deeply connected. I've seen many examples of music prompting the recollection of the forgotten memories. One such case of the patient of mine who would play various phases on the piano, seemingly using the notes on the phase as tools to explore her own mind. She started to play several uh, similar phases over and over, changing the keys slightly each time. Repeat, repeat, repeat. <sighs> hey, can you can you be quiet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's better. Yeah, tone it down. I'm trying to read. Right. Oh, she's so rude. Pardon her. Those phases must have had some connection to her deeply buried memories and the improvement in her condition of dramatic surprisings. Unfortunately, she killed herself after recovering her memories. This case ended in failure, but what can, uh, what's uh, certain, sorry, I'm trying to say concern, certain is that the music can reach deep regions of the minds in, inaccessible to mere language, if you say so. There is music like that on the island I remember hearing when I was a child. They call them moon sounds, so kind of like the music that they play throughout the building that we've been hearing. There are different kinds of moon sounds, but I remember some of them being used during rituals and festivals. Most of the moon sounds have been passed down by the words of mouth and melodies of the ancients, but I've definitely seen documents about them somewhere. Seems worth coming back on this island in the end. Black Notebook. Who said this? Right, can I? There we go. <laughs> Hmm. Ayako in bed. Why do you have two separate beds? Why do you have two separate beds with red string around? A four poster bed. Red cords are tied between the posts. There is no one in the bed. Yes, yeah, just a. Uh... Empty room. There we go. Yep. Uh, right. Dining hall? Sounds grand. Let's go. So I have a theory of this room, right? Because it was never said. I will mention it once we get out of here because obviously the music in here. Oh, let's grab this actually. Let's grab this because I've lost mine during that fight with her. There we go. Excellent. Let's leave. I like your lighting in your room, Ayako, but you suck. Right. Right. So, the gargly in there, right? I don't. I believe. Now, I could be wrong. There could be a note. But I have a theory that the gargling in there, right? In Ayako's room. Because these are just little pieces I'm putting together ever so slightly and I'm just thinking and it does kind of make sense. So that gargling in there, I think is the nurse. The nurse that we literally just fought. The nurse that we always keep seeing in this building and then if you remember last time maybe I might be able to find a picture of it actually. Yes, I think it's this nurse. I think it's uh, Fuyuko. I think it's Fuyuko. And... Uh, let's have a look. Uh, here we go. Oh no, it, it didn't catch the actual photo of her. It just caught the nurse. Oh, oh no, nurse me. No, no, no. Where is it? Girl, per here we go. Right here. Ayako, a patient whom Director Hybera treats differently from the others. She loves to break her toys more than anything else in the world. I So we took this, I believe we might have took this as Misaki, right? Um, so the timeline, if you notice timeline between the girls, uh, go back and forth. Duka is the last girl to arrive on this island. So right now we're bouncing back, like, back and forth. So Mitsuki is in the future of this right now. Like she's ahead of us, right? She's like a chapter ahead of us. We're behind. So when we, as Ruka just then, uh, went to the office and we heard the, the comm play, like, you know, like the phone call going off, right? The comms. Um, and it's Ayako saying, my toy is broken. Bring me a toy kind of thing. And then the nurse behind us said, oh no, not Ayako. I have a feeling that scene came first and this 
pitch here, what happened here, Ayako Pauling Nurse came second. And that gargling, I have a feeling, I don't know how, but Ayako really messed up the nurse. And the nurse is somewhere buried in that room. And that's her making the gargling. And I think it's the nurse. Since if we have a look at the nurse as well, uh, Fuyuka, I think it is. Where, where is your face, my love? You do have a pretty face, honestly. Where is she? Well, look, you can kind of see it here, kind of. But the few times we've engaged with her, yeah, that's the only time we really saw her face, huh? Um, the few times we've seen her, she, yeah, here you go. You can see that her left eye looks like it's gouged. Her hands look like they're bruised that she's been fighting back. There's blood splatter all in her uniform, on her hat. She's got it around her mouth and all that jazz. Like her left eye looks like it's been gouged out, right? And Ayako, as we just read, she sympathizes with violence. I have a feeling the gargly in the room is this poor nurse who was addressed, who was assigned to Ayako, unfortunately, and Ayako, quote unquote, broke her. That is my theory. And it just it just sends me shivers. It's just gross. It's just gross. And I, that's why I can't help but feel so, so bad for this nurse. Especially because this nurse actually really cared for Madoka as well. And she... She should have been signed to Madoka. Yeah, I keep going back and forth with her name as well. I'm so sorry. But yeah, that's my theory. I feel so sorry for that nurse. Poor thing. Ayako is such a witch. Ah! What now? Hi, hi. Hold on. Quick save. Ah. There's something over here too. Oh, is, do they mean the telephone? Mushy, mushy. I'm really going to get punished for doing that. Right, I want to have a look. No, no, no. Telephone. It's unknown voice. Is it? A call from an unknown person trying to tell... Oh, no, no, that's Choshiro. That's with Choshiro. Never mind. Ah, uh, I really... Oh, we've got a tape here as well. Okay. We will get to the tape when we get to... Uh, uh, Choshiro, since it's more of his thing. I'd rather just do it that way and move on because we're reading so, so much. Okay, um, that didn't sound like Modoka. The thing she said, it did sound like a Modoka, but I, I don't think it was because it didn't sound like her voice. And I'm pretty sure we've heard the loss of Modoka anyway, which is just so sad. Right, to the dining hall, yeah. <gasps> Ooh, ooh! Mummy, hello? 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 Oh, she's following me. Oh, she is following me. Yeah, I'm following you too. Ooh! How did I... Oh my god, I'm such a dummy. I forgot about this chapter! Oh, how did I forget what was happening in this chapter? Oh, she looks so good! She looks a little less scary, and I don't, I don't, I don't think I like that. But she, oh, she's beautiful. Oh, she's so pretty. Ooh, okay. You know what? I keep getting those, and I might as well. I have sixty. Oh my god. Oh, could I? Right, I'll wait out, I'll wait out, I'll wait till I see, I'll wait till I see if I get, um, another one, another lens. Hi, Uncle Sol! How are you? 
You love this game? Oh good, so do I. I absolutely adore this game and I'm so happy for the remake. It's a projector. It looks like it takes rooms. Oh yeah, of course. Wait, wait. We're going to the we're going to the piano, aren't we? Don't touch me. I fucking knew it! You! We are in a buffet! Wait your turn! Don't think it's a buffet actually, I think it's just literally a dining hall. Why is this glowing? Have you got an item here or are you just saying, hey, you need to go to here? I just remember what they do in this game. Yes, I, re I remember this. Oh, I wonder how this is going to play out now, actually. Please don't tell me I need to do the touchpad on the controller. I'm going to be very upset. <laughs> The classic, oh no, scary ghost experience internet user <laughs> comes here. I'm super neat, thanks Queen, what about you? I'm really well, thank you, Han. I'm glad to hear you're doing well. I know, I love, I love this game. Oh, I'm so happy. Um, I knew what was happening in the beginning when we got the introduction. And then I forgot because so many other things were happening and then I was giving out my theories and I just went off the wagon and then that ghost appeared and I was like, oh my gosh, I remember what's happening in this chapter. So exciting. Uh, yes, right. So uh, this game with Duka at least, we're corresponding to the keys. So it's like a little mini game, which Fatal Frame tend to have those ever so slightly and they're quite, they're quite cute. I want to know how this is going to work out. According to score, it should sound like this. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, it highlights for me. Fair enough. I know this song. I've heard it before. It's a really beautiful tune. When we get to actually play it, it's so beautiful. Oh, I appreciate you, lovely. <laughs> Yes, get all the snacks and drinks you need. <laughs> Where are we going, Ruka? Oh, it's your name! <gasps> yes, I always took that lift. Did you now? That was, um... That plate definitely said her name. Are we actually going to your room finally? I think it's your room and Mitsuki's bedroom we haven't actually explored yet. Luckily for us, the elevator's right here. <gasps> yes! Yes! Oh, yes! Ashley got those German sausages that go perfect with beer and wait for it. Beer all oh, the evening. <laughs> oh, I hope you have a really lovely evening. I hope your day's actually been really well. A letter dropped by the woman in black. What a badass name. There's something on the floor. What could be the matter with you of late? Why are you in such a foul mood? Oh, this is a different translation. Well, maybe not different, but I remember it sounding different. This is quite nice. Back then, when I first told you how I felt about you, you rejected me completely and utterly, even though you always smiled at me after you became me. I want to see you smile like that again. Where shall we go for a walk today? Oh, I'm so excited for these guys. I want to know. Mm -hmm. Hold on. There, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. I want to follow them. I want to follow them. <laughs> I'm going to follow them. Hold on. I'm going to save real quickly. I'm going to save real quickly. Um, yes, yes. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna follow them. 
I'm really interested in these two characters like a lot. Like they're super, super cool. See where they're going. Does she go this way? Ooh. Right, hold on. Oh! Oh, wait! Oh, right, I didn't take damage. Okay, never mind. I thought I took damage since. <laughs> why the why the fudge could I possibly reject such a queen? You are so sweet. You're too much. You always lift me up, and I absolutely adore and I love love you. Oh, what is here? Oh, slow. Oh, <laughs> cool. They would give us a. I know exactly why they're giving us the slow lens here. <laughs> buggers, absolute buggers. No, 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 I don't want to upgrade the lens. I want to equip, sorry. Um, uh, oh wait, can I not have, can I not have up to, th oh yeah, 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 I just did it there. Yes, yes. There we go. Where did that go? Wait, it's so blue here. Can we go across here anymore? No, we can't. Okay. They've actually completely changed that. Ooh, why is the filament yellow? Oh, look, do you see her? <laughs> She's in her chair. Oh, I think these women, like right now what I'm doing, I think it might be optional, but like, how, why the hell would you not want to do this? I'm torturing myself right now. Go away, you creep off beyond the fence. How dare you? I will not tolerate your filthy hand on me. I want whatever this is. Five jelly beans. Ooh. Woman in wheelchair. Oh my gosh, she's not. He. Oh look, there's. Oh look, there's the uh, there's the moon in the the pool. By the way, guys, <laughs> look at her. Her head, She's she is very she's very pretty. I don't know why we're doing this, but. <sighs> don't touch me. Don't touch me. Ooh. Oh, your hair is very beautiful. This is gonna suck this fight, by the way. Like, I just put myself in such hard mode. Oh, look at her. Oh. No, no, no. Luca, I need you to turn around. Oh, hi. Oh, God. I need to freeze this one. You hurt! Oh god! <gasps> She's very beautiful. Oh god! Oh, oh, so creepy. So, so creepy. So creepy. <gasps> okay. Lady? Oh, stop disappearing. I need her. She's just gonna dash at me and I hate it. So yeah, she's a doll. Ooh, you're quite strong. You are very strong. Oh, the doll is running around somewhere. 
that shit behind me. Yeah, so this is a doll. This is a doll that's chasing after me right now. Okay, I freezed her. Whoa. Oh god. I need you. I need you. Because you will stop her. Oh. Oh. Let's run through her. There we go. It's so hard to be scared of you because you are just so gorgeous in this remake. Like, what the heck? I'm going to keep moving backwards because, yeah, she's on my side. I need a fail frame chance of you. No, no, I don't... Got you. Ah. Oh, I think... So, the music, not music really, but the talking in the background, you can hear that one's calmly speaking, and the other one is screaming, and I have a feeling it's the doll that's screaming. I'm not sure what she's saying. I, I can hear she's saying Watashi, which she's saying I am, but I don't know what else she's saying. Oh god. Oh, why are you walking like that? Oh, you cheeky bugger. So she one-shots me so her other sister can come and grab me on the next. Uh, there you go, Lek. Dan, she looks so emo. <laughs> I mean, I understand that the point of the fight to dodge and overcome, but I'll run, I know, right? <laughs> She besides stepping better than the typical Overwatch teammate. Oh gosh, I know. Me lady. Oh. Oh god, she's really screaming. I think she's always gonna be next to her sister. Don't charge at me. Okay, they're both in echo. Oh, you know, it'd be nice if I had my... Oh god, oh god, oh god! <gasps> what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> Oh my god, she was pointing me to her sister. I say sister, I, I'm i not exactly sure what these two were. She calls her, like, me, but I, th I think I might get them mixed up with the translation. I think the translation is saying it's a sister, but we'll know more in the future. Oh, I'm running out of film, no way. Why can't I take a picture of you? What the heck? Also, are you recharging your health? Got you! Yes! 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 There's something on the ground by the pool. Oh, that was a tough fight. That was a very tough fight I put myself into. 
but we did it. Whew. A copper key. Found an old key with words switched board room in, uh, inscribed on it. Yeah, no, show me where that is, because I have no idea where that is. Oh! What is it now? Your eyes are beautiful. This feeling? Um. Oh no, we gotta go. Ruka, we gotta go, and not because we're out of film. We've gotta go! We've gotta go! The actual queen is here! We gotta leave! <laughs> We can't fight that. We cannot fight that. Ah, uh, and she touches me. That's it. It's game over. Oh, that was close. <laughs> oh, that was close. I'm sorry, where? Where? Oh. Oh, where the heck was that, huh? Where was that during my fight? Wait, am I even going the right way? Uh, oh, screw it, we'll go to the map here. There we go. Um... No, it's behind me. I thought so. Oh, uh, this way, sweetie. Oh, no, no, she's... Oh god, she's got the spirit. Uh, tips fedora milady <laughs> the mc walking animation is so sins for i really need to see <laughs> i know a little a little um gallop is so cute so is it this room oh <gasps> it is i need to pull my Hair back. Okay. Oh, hello. Nice. There is totally a hidden doll in here somewhere. Totally. Look at it. It's all clots. It's all clutters. I never played The Sims. I would really like to play it. Oh, this is this is oh, this is so bloody small, so tight in here. Like, where did she send us? Why does she have this key, dude? It's so crowded in here. I know there's a thing. I think there's a doll underneath me. Actually, is she in this one? Yeah, there you are. There you are. I remember. Doors unlocked? That just looks horrible. That just looks horrible. Yeah, no, that just looks horrible. Oh, there's a Tory gate in here. Um, right. What does this map say? A whole bunch of nothing. So there's a door here, and there's a door here. This is what I call sidetracking at its best. Well, actually, no, I think it's... Mm, is it part of the story? Yeah, side story. That's what I love about Fatal Frames. It's sidetrack gives you more story lore, like, lore of these people. Oh! Oh god, oh god, okay, I know where we are, I know where we are. So this is where the big cheese came out of, and I was saying we have to run. Because obviously if she touches us, we're dead. And as Duka was saying as well, you c you cannot look at her. Like, don't look at her. But I w what I will say though, apart from Ruka's got really cute little flower patterns on her sleeves there, her straps. Um, the lady looks quite familiar, does she not? Haha. <laughs> 
Jesus, look at that door. Oh my gosh. Ugh. This must be the switch room. It seems like everything is still working. Yeah. There's a control panel, but it doesn't seem to be working at the moment. Didn't she just say everything seems to be working? Why are you lying? Is there another little doll in here? No. No? <gasps> I know what that is! This! Ooh! We saw one earlier. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. On duty nurse's memo. Okay, I remember if this is if this is the one I'm thinking of, the memo. By the way, I'm talking about the reading here. Um, shockingly enough. I think this one was a good one. This is the one I would recommend not missing out on. I think. Oh no, it's not <sighs> Okay, there I, or was it a cutscene? See, my memory's <laughs> I love that my memory is so infatuated with this game's story of how their memory is also trying to put two pieces together like a puzzle. I, I think it was something to read or it was a cutscene and it was like a really cool, like quite um, a gripping scene. Today's on duty nurse, the password for the door to the third floor ward has been changed to 1956. There are some extremely sick patients on the third floor, so please be very careful with the door to that floor. Oh dear. And I don't think the kind of sick as in bedridden sick either. So will this open? No. Oh, I was really hoping this was going to open. Why is this blue? Wait, are you blue? No, the filament isn't gone. Wait. Why? So this is blue because of the switch. Switchboard written, okay. Are you looking at this? Are you looking at this? Oh no, is it just literally that? Wasn't... Oh. There was something here. <gasps> Don't touch me! I bloody knew it. I bloody knew it. Ten, uh, ten jelly. See, now, Mr. Hand, if you were just trying to grab me because of the jelly beans, I would have shared with you. But since you did that and gave me and Druka a heart attack, you're not having a share. Sodja. Why is there still blue? Like right here. Is it just this? Cause, oh, because I'm getting closer. Okay, alright. So that's everything we can do in here. Alright. Damn. I was hoping that door would open, but it doesn't. Not for now, at least. I like that room. And I really like how like quiet it is in here as well. <laughs> this is such a relaxing game. No, honestly, I do find Face of Frame quite a relaxing game to play. <laughs> right, the lift. The lift. Um She gave me so I have a code to go to the third floor. Interestingly enough, the map didn't actually show me the third floor. Uh Oh wait, can I... No? Here we go. Infirmary third floor, hold on. Infirmary third floor. Oh no, we've not been there yet. Okay, maybe we might trigger it with Ruka. I don't know where she wants to go in this lift. So, let me have a look. Wait, it's not switched? Oh. Oh, wait, you're not going to send me back down to the basement, are you? The lift service floor, one to four. The key is required to access the fourth floor. We literally just went there. We literally just went, ah, guys, I'm so sorry. But you won't know because I'm just going to, I'm going to literally just edit it right here. 
Switch off and on there, and the code activates 23. Okay. Well, I know where it is now. Regetsu was built as a sanctorium. I felt like Regetsu was built as a bit of everything at this point. It's a hospital, it's a museum, it's a festival, now it's a sanctorium. Um, hybrid art infirmary, but there are also guest facilities on the first floor. The rooms in the building all have been named with a moon for a uh, motive. So, um... Oh, right. Entrance hall, dining hall. The Oso Museum, dedicated to Professor Oso, the man who has built this camera that we're using, by the way. Uh, and the features important materials on display. Entrance is free. Anyone wishing to visit should apply at the reception. Pale moon, uh, the pool in the moon, flower garden. Ah, courtyard may be used freely between July and October. So it stays quite warm in Japan. Note to staff regarding underground floors. Entrance to the rooms other than the switchboard room and water storage room is strictly prohibited. Okay. I can't think of, like, <laughs> not saying the word prohibited without thinking of 2B. Ooh! You really want me to level up my blast, huh? Right, let's hippity hoppity back down here, I guess. So we get to continue that room. I thought we do. I just thought at a later date. Ugh, I just don't like how cramped it is in here. It's just so freaky. So freaky. And that door's even freakier. Right, we need to go to the switchboard, which... Ruka said this room is working, and we went to the switchboard, it wasn't working. Are you working now? Now you're working. So... 23. Oh, too much, too much, too much. Ooh, way too much, way too much. Way too much, it's over here somewhere. Too much. Fudge. So for anyone that's like, what the heck in mini game central is going on here? I've got to get this to 23. That's all I've got to do. So, let me put these all down. Where do you go if I put you all down? Oh, you bugger. Um, okay. Ah, oh, you bugger! <laughs> I'm on to you. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love how quick my, my, my brain works when it gets going. This is what my brain sounds like in the background. <laughs> the mechanical sound noise, the lift must be working. Ah. Patrolling man. Well, you give me a warning from a distance to know you're coming for me to hide. My friend just texted me and he got a shibby. <gasps> Has he? What's he calling it? I hope your friend's prepared for how much- Ah! 
The living shall not enter? Okay. I hope your friends prepared that they... Actually, no, they don't even bark, they scream. No, 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 I didn't. We definitely cannot open that. Look at it, it is sealed to the brim. I want this. No name yet? Ah, oh, cute. Anything will be cute. Now you gotta get them those typical little cute bandanas around their neck. <laughs> Got a pierce lend. Oh, this is so worth it. It's so worth it. Let's you take more powerful shots for a fixed amount of time when used. Oh, yes. And we'll just do that. Unless I know I wanted to... Oh no, I already spent it on power. Yeah, it's good. Uh, yeah, no, we're all good. So, fun fact, right? This room we're in, yeah? So, back on the... Um, so, when this game wasn't released, you were able to emulate this. But some ghosts broke the game. And this ghost right here would break the game. So you wouldn't be able to enter this room at all and you would miss out on a picture and that camera lens. Now you might be thinking, would it interfere with later game? It actually doesn't. So you can come here at the later game, but if you follow this specific ghost into this room, it crashes your game and it sucks. So we never got to do this. Um, I never even got to play this emulated version anyway, but I used to watch it. This is like a first time of me having a go at this game and I love it. I'm, I'm so excited. I've only got to watch this, so playing it is just oh, breathtaking. <sighs> what do you want? Why won't it open? You are too close. Okay, hold on. Because my TV is asking me, hey, do you want to shut down? And I'm just like, no. Hey. I don't know what you're saying. I'm sorry. Ooh, I want to look closer look at your mask. Yeah. It looks like he's bleeding underneath it. So cool. Ooh. What did I do? Oh, what did I do? <laughs> you can't touch Luca. On the court of the unhallowed. Something is lying here where the ghost disappeared. That, okay, for someone that's played Fatal Frame for years, like I grew up with it, right? I can tell you now, just by looking at this image, that is one important book, if not a tome. That looks like a tome. The resident of the deceased. The faces, uh, the face of the disease can change and thus be in danger of blooming. On the first sign of blooming in the disease, thou must harvest the face and remove the bud. You remove their face? Is that why he was bleeding underneath? Oh my god, that's some leather face nonsense. Being done, thou must place a false face on them that doth be like their face uh, their face, and preserve their appearance as when living. The mask be- oh my god, this becomes- I didn't even know that that's even a word back in the day. <laughs> Part of the deceased, the mask becomes the deceased, the deceased becomes the mask. Let not the living into the court of the unhallowed, le uh, lest their minds be lost and they be in charge, uh, in danger of budding. Sorry, only those who are trained and have moonlight in their soul may enter. But be thou warned, 
Let not any soul into the court on nights when the moon be not full. It feels like I'm reading Final Fantasy XIV online again. <laughs> Damn, girl, that makeup is so 2007! <laughs> oh. That's what my eyeliner would be looking like when I was like 15, trying, trying to get that Avril Lavigne look. <sighs> just find out years later, I just don't suit the makeup, sadly. <laughs> no. No! Why? Oh. No! No! Why are you here? Oh god, Ruka, run. Run. Run! She can glide through walls. <gasps> Fudge. Oh, I'm so ballsy. Open it. <gasps> Give me colour. Give me back my colour. Give me back my colour. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Oh goodness! No, you cannot be doing that teleporting nonsense when I haven't even got like the twist and turning down. Oh my god, what? What? Why were you close to be- what? <laughs> Why did I go so close to him? <sighs> okay, I remember that ghost. I remember really liking that ghost. If I recall... Oh my gosh, she's spoiling. Shush, shush. If I recall, I think his name... I think it was Short. I remember my brain saying Mackie. I think his name was Short for Mackie or something. And I actually really liked that ghost. Um, wow. He's not till a later date. Holy crap. Where the hell were we taking this? I don't think we can go to the fourth floor. Yeah. No. Nah. So I think third we can do... Yeah, stilts and motions. Okay. I don't mind taking a lift ride with him. He's 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 chill. He he's got spirit. He's he's nice. He's nice. The foot. Okay. All right. Okay. Well, we know who lives up here. Corridors blocked by a red wheelchair. You mean... Oh. Look how much that wheelchair stands out. Look how much that stands out. You just know. You just know it means something big. Didn't they say, didn't a note just say, be careful of patients on the third floor as they're like extremely like, quote unquote, ill? <laughs> huh? He's calling, who's calling? Nurse waiting. Who's calling bestie? Oh, so many stuff in here. Oh, there's a key item in here. I think that's why it's going blue. Oh, room three. Third floor room's assignments. Okay. 
New building, third floor status, end of July, rune 308, silent moon. Oh, it's us! We're on the third floor! Oh, we're really sensitive! We're really, like... I don't like calling them, like, oh, sick patients. But, like... Wow, we're really severe. Notes. We have been asked uh, to report the results of Ruka's musical therapy. Report for progression of her Moonlight Syndrome. <clears throat> <clears throat> Symptoms to the director, as well as uh, which Moonlight she responds to. Sorry. 309. Faded Moon. Magaki Yoko. Oh, I think this is him! This is the one- this, oh, okay, I must have- I must have gave him a nickname, sorry. I think this is the guy that was in the lift of us just then. A generous donor to the facility. Ah, oh, he gets upset if you enter his room while he is painting. Please avoid doing so if possible. Also, never touch his painting. Oh, he's a painter! Ah, he is lovely. Faded moon. Okay, so Magaki. Magaki? Magaki Yuko. Okay. What a lovely name. 3010, Waney Moon. Uh, also, Misaki. Oh, Misaki's also third floor with us. Hey, bestie. Misaki is receiving special treatment directly from director Haibara. She is quite delicate, so do not let her make contact with the patient on the fourth floor. Hmm. Room 311, Waxing Moon. Sendo Kagiri. Kagiri is being treated by the director in conjunction with her family doctor. Do not enter her special treatment room except in an absolute emergency. Kagiri. Sendo. Ka Kagiri Sendo. Kagiri is being treated by the director in conjunction with her family doctor. Huh. Okay, so... We're on this floor right now, obviously. We've got my room, we've got Maki's room, Misaki's room, and, um, yeah, this person, Kagiri. Okay, I don't think we've met Kagiri yet. Go to your former room. Okay. Oh god. Is there anything else in here? Apparently, you know what, apparently it's a lot easier to do this, uh, to look around if there's any items, but I find that very creepy to do so. Maybe it's outside. Oh, there we go, it worked. Yeah, yeah, it's here. It's here. Oh, lovely. Thank you. Don't touch me. Okay. You never want to grab me for red jelly beans. You just like blue jelly beans. What is this? Oh, it's a person. Right. Okay. Wait. Something's still here. Something is still here. Can I make it pop up? Something's still here. Oh, wait. Are you looking at this? Ah. Oh my god, what was the code? Oh, what was the code? That isn't it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh no. Where did we read that? It was the lift uh thingy, wasn't it? It was it was the lift. Lift papers. Records. Uh Oh, what was it? What number was it? I one nine wasn't it five as well? Ah, damn it. Uh, 
I could not even tell you what the um, that note could even been called. No, that ain't it. Is it this? Is this just a different picture? No, no, no. No, 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 no. No. Wandering patients, no, that was at the beginning. Nope, that's telling me how to do that. Oh no! Do you guys have any idea? Do you remember what the number was that we found in the the lift? I don't think it was any of these. Oh, this! Oh my God, look. There we go. On duty. Uh, sorry. Go back. Oh wait, go back. Can't believe I was like right there. And <laughs> yeah. Wait, is this not it? No clue. I'm stupid. You're not stupid. I think I'm being stupid right now. Wait, so this isn't it? Okay, well, well, I found that memo now, so now I need to read this. So, on duty, the password for the door to the third floor ward has been changed to 1956. Oh, did I put 5-1 again? Wait. Oh, why is my memory being so stupid? That's what I want to know. My memory's being silly. I have a feeling... This isn't it, but I'm just like checking real quick. Like my mind's just racing so many things ahead and I don't know why. No, it is. I was I literally was putting in the first code. <sighs> what? Where oh, were you minus? You look nice though. You seem nice. <gasps> Look at their little guest slippers. Ah, oh, patient slippers. That's so nice. I knew she was going to say that. I wanted to say that. Is she? Yeah. <laughs> it's your one, sweetie. Ah, <laughs> oh. end of her chapter. I've always liked her chapters. Like, honestly, all of them are so dope. Like, I was thinking of this, like, the other day. None of their chapters are very luck- lack- cause- Get your words out, woman. None of their chapters are lacklustering at all. They're all so good. They're all so good. None of them have lacklustering at all. Um, I think I just really enjoy Ruka's, um, cause obviously I'm very- I, I love her perspective of the story. But they've all, they've all, oh, they've 